law of momentum and impulse lab. I will be proving today that even if you have the same force with an egg and you throw it, depending on what you throw it at with the force and the time it impacts, it may not break. For example, the blanketed chairs, you know, we may see an egg thrown at that. But for example, if we took this plate and this egg, and you know, just went, wah! That's what happens. <laughs> but, as you can see, this beautiful egg, nice pretty face, <laughs> hopefully this works. We throw it at this blanket, the exact same force that I threw that egg at that plate. Apparently, she will not break. Test number one. And I cracked her. But, as you can see, since she still hit the blanket, and the amount of force that I threw it at that blanket, and the time that it was impacted, was greater than the time when that egg impacted that plate. That sucks. It let her not break until she hit the fence. <laughs> and... Test number two with Evil Stalker Man. Let's hope I hit the blanket this time. Batter up! He does not break! Look at that, ladies and gentlemen! What a great example of momentum and impulse. Woohoo! Woohoo! There you have it, it's not just me. What the impact doing? of a hard surface on an egg just falling from gravity. Yeah. Boom! Roasted. No. She died. But the stalker dude's still alive. Oh well. And that is what happens when you drop an egg due to gravity by accident. No, he's still fine. That that he died. He's suffered too much of an internal injury. As you can tell, he's losing all of his blood. What are you talking about? He's fine. Look, I can just take his shell off. There we go. <laughs> Look at him! Let's see his face. He's better than ever! Oh, yeah, he looks great. I know! Ah! Acceleration due to gravity. Ah! What a bitch.